Hey guys and welcome back. Another Alliance War video here from the past, from last season. And this war we are facing SAS. Uh, my former team actually, I've been there for two seasons earlier. And um, I'm going to start off on path six where I have to fight the strife. And this is still the old uh, tactics, the mystic. And this fight was pretty tricky and I made a couple of mistakes which you'll see in the video. I'm going with a full Corvus team here because I have to use Corvus for path 6 and then I go to path 2 in section 2 and then I have to do a mini boss Penny Parker as well. So let's watch. So pretty much I do the strife because I need to ramp up or get a mission on Corvus. This is not the easiest um, ramp up fight because he has mystic uh, mystic so you can miss him when you do and also if you do like five crit hits he'll go invisible with his shield thingy and so you have to like be careful of two things and maybe i should have uh, used a power start one boost here i opted not to um which might have been a mistake so in theory you want to bait out his special ones you want to be uh, you need to worry about him getting to five of his thingies so he gains the shield and then you have to be worried about the mystic as well when you do evade so and all already from the start i just mess up with his shield um which kind of sucks i take like a hit to the face but it's only like 17 percent, so it's not the, the end of the world just keep parrying keep hitting um have to be have to worry about the the purple icon in the right corner um on how many he gets when he gets to five you miss as you see here and i just missed on the special two which is pretty bad i should have just uh given him two more hits get him to five and then use the special two so i'm kind of up against the ropes i push him to a special two here pretty dumb also uh, i can block it without dying here and i need to bait it out but uh, i'm gonna be pretty much in the corner after that so can't really afford to take more hits to the face and now i have to evade i should probably just have blocked that so i didn't trigger the mystic that was a mistake as well and here we go the mystic comes in and i hit into the air and i die um couple of it's not an easy fight but a couple of mistakes that could have been avoided and i'm, I'm kind of angry that i did those but uh it happens even in even with uh all people make mistakes um which sucks um i haven't really tried the fight before either so i'm not trying to defend myself i shouldn't have died but it happens i've died before and i'll probably die again so it sucks nothing i can do about it have to revive have to heal up because i'm using covers for all my fights so nothing i can do here um have to go back in get the mission so Hopefully learn from your mistakes and don't die again. Get the Corvus charge and move on. So here he's at four, five, get it away. Perfect. Evade here. Be be aver aware of his uh, mystic now. And I get it away here. Just hit into the air once, move back. And then I, I, I thought it was gone, but it wasn't. And then he goes with his shield so now i just have to get a special two in and he's dead so still one mistake in the second fight i should have avoided but nothing i can really do about it this was my only fight in section one because as you see here it's an empty path so let's go to section two in section two i have path two and now my corvus has a mission so it's a lot easier um for this fight particularly, I don't need the cosmic boots, but I kind of want them for the last mini fight. And since they don't expire uh, before the war is over, because I can do it all in one sweep, I, can, I might as well just add them now so I don't have to worry about it later if something happens or I make a mistake or whatever. So just putting on small rainbow boosts here. Get uh, back to the fight just to make sure everything's okay. To an advanced power boost so we're ready to party i can do all three fights i have to do here with one um with one three minute boost so might as well it's a fairly straightforward fight um 
normally you need to be careful of the heavy and the light and medium attacks here but since he's probably gonna die pretty fast I'm just gonna make sure that I get to a special 2 and can kill him in one special 2 the people who say Corvus is overrated clearly have not seen him put in some work he's pretty good both in AQ and Alliance War and still in content then I have to do Iron Man Infinity War kind of the same um, as the last fight get to special 2 and he's dead so just have to play it slow let's do some hits as you can see here like 16k crits not bad at all fade out a heavy and then we're ready to go just one special 2 GG's pretty easy standard Corvus fights in the end we have the Penny Parker mini and I brought White Max because I need to apply that for her limber just in case it's not needed per se in this fight because it's going to be pretty fast but better safe than sorry when I'm using Corvus anyway probably should have used and I added uh, two White Max for other people on the path that's why I don't have any left and the the only note that really matters here is the limber the, the rest doesn't matter because the fight's not going to be long enough for that to matter and we don't really need to knock her shield down we could have done it it would probably only take two hits because of a ramp course as you see here he, he took like 68 on the shield here he's going to bait out a special even taking it to the face because i forgot to block pretty bad and just make sure i have my glaive, uh, glaive charges up do a special two I could have just gone another special too, but I just wanted to play it safe without hitting into the air. Um, and just special three, and the fight is over. We ended up actually losing this war, not because of my death. We lost by three, I think. So, but it still sucks dying in alliance war, and uh, it feels kind of bad. But I mean, nothing I can do about it. The rest of the fights were pretty standard Corvus Glaive fights. Let me know if you like these Lions War videos. The last one uh, didn't get as many views as I hoped for, but hopefully if I do more and more people will like it. I hope that some of you enjoy them and let me know in the comment section what you think about Alliance War videos if you'd like to see more. And if so, let me know what you want when I do future Alliance War. Is this something I need to do? Something I need to do differently? The next the newest ones I've done, I also uh, scroll through the notes so you can see um, what's in the notes. But other than that, I would like suggestions on what to do. Also, if you have suggestions for other content, let me know. And remember to like the video if you like the video, obviously. And remember to subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you in the next one.